All right, Gabe, let's take a look at your paper. Uh, Emily, format first. Make sure this is Times New Roman. You got a space above here. You need to move the paper up a little bit. Um, eh, not the best title in the world. Maybe a little bit uh, more conducive to your theme down here. All right, here's something you need to work on. You got a couple different examples of, of putting things in parentheses. Think of parentheses as if you took them out of the sentence, it would still make sense. So according to and then you take it out. So eventually, so you really don't need those um, parentheses there. And then they should see fame as an unlikely talent. But again, why did you put parentheses there? Because you can't just take it out. I think you meant to do quotes here, um, maybe. I don't know. Here's my problem with at least the first part of this whole paragraph is that According to this website, there's a certain formula you have to follow. Remember that this is written in second person point of view. So essentially it's you telling somebody else how to be rich and famous. So I don't want to I don't want to know their reasons or steps to become rich and famous. I want to know your steps to become rich and famous. Um, so that's where where I'm losing it a little bit with this first part. Now you jump right into it because according to this place, the formula to becoming famous is shock. Shock doesn't need to be capitalized. Um, no comma here. Remember only comma conjunction when you have two complete sentences. Fame doesn't need to be capitalized. Um, so capturing someone's attention uh, are great examples of how people must see fame, must see fame in their life. I'm not sure. Must, I don't know. First step to think of is doing something incredibly stupid to attract attention to oneself after one gets people's attention. Again, this is second person point of view. The first step you should do is something incredible in order to attract attention to yourself, so on and so forth. So don't use oneself. Um, this is all second person. Um, soon you will see fame in your life, even if it's from YouTube. Lawsuits are making the wrong people mad. This is funny. Um, now you're starting to use you. You'll notice yourself getting a start on the Walk of Fame in no time. Um, and again, I don't want to know that it's there. I mean, you may have stolen it from them, but that just means that you didn't come up with your own original ideas here. Um, shock, attention, and then fame. So again, don't capitalize those. Um, this is not a thesis statement. A thesis statement is thematic. So what theme are you trying to portray with your main points? So try to fix that as well. All right, so... We're having problem again with the concept of a second person point of view. So this is this is acting more like just a research. Um, remember, these are steps to become rich and famous. So your first step is to shock the world. So you have to give them advice on how to do this. Now, I want examples too, but your whole thing is Donald Trump did this, Kardashian did this, Nicki Minaj did this, and all of them shocked the world. Okay. But you're not actually telling the reader what they need to do. So it's got to be you telling them what to do. Um, so you need to capitalize T for Trump. Um, and this is, I don't get this. Trump repaid his loan, but his idea was stupid at first because he simply did not know if his business would ever even succeed like he needed to in order to pay off his loan. I don't know why that's, like, it's stupid that he asked for a million dollars and he made it work. I don't know. I, I, I just, I kind of see your logic, but I don't get it, okay? Being stupid also raised to Kim Kardashian. Um, I, I'm not going to fact check this, but I'm pretty sure she wasn't a porn star. Um, and her, the fame of their family kind of came from their parents more than the kids. Um, she didn't really start her own television show. Uh, no comma here as Keeping Up with the Kardashians is, I think, the actual title of the show. Oops. Um I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna spell or fact check this too, but um, actually go back. Sorry, with Trump, you have a source in your MLA that's about Trump, but you don't have any citation here. You don't have any citation here. You don't have any. You have this citation, but this isn't in your works cited page either. The Go Banking. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, but this is actually what should go into your in-text citation. That whole thing right there. Okay. Actually, we'll just jump down to work cited page. This goes out. This goes. It gets cut out. Everything gets moved over and then alphabetized by the first thing. So it'll be this one, this one, this one. Okay. All right. Let's go back up. 
So she now has a net worth of $70 million. Um, they shocked the world by showing how little they knew, but also how desperate they were. So no comment here. I don't see any desperation in any of these people. Um, so how, how does that make sense? So it appears to be true that shock did lead to the getting to the getting attention to getting attention. No space here. Um, all right, now I'm confused, Gabe. So your first step was about shock, but now your second step is about shock too. Why? Why is this? <laughs> this is almost like a preview for your next paragraph because you're just talking about the same thing. You got to have three separate. Uh, shock attention and then fame so you did shock so this should be how you draw attention to yourself which um, you're not uh, you, you never phrase it you're only talking about shock you could phrase this as how they drew attention to themselves Donald Trump you know became president-elect he drew so much attention to himself that he started his own um, television show which then started you know sort of on this path to be president-elect um, Kim Kardashian used the show to, you know, gain attention for this, this, and this. I guess you could rephrase this to be about attention, but you never talk about attention at all in here. You're just kind of repeating what you just said, but adding some more details. No citation for this. You put it in quotes, but there's no citation where you got it from. Um, that's remember when we have television shows television shows are not put in quotes I should have told you that up here not put in quotes um, it should be underlined because uh, it's a TV show um, making her way Nicki Minaj made the judgment call to get a boob and booty job so this is kind of an awkward phrase so now you're she drew the eyes of perverted men um, so no comma, but that she had no money to go with her makeover, starting to, okay, space issue here, started to wrapping trash, shocking, right? So you got to separate this and make this a um, couple different sentences. So now you're talking about led to attention, but that's not really what you're talking about in here. Make it clear up here that this is about drawing attention to yourself, add in details that you didn't do in this paragraph. Um, and have a stronger transition here that are um, having all this attention so strong and forceful led directly to having their their fame be recognized I don't know something like that but again this is not second person point of view you're not I don't even know if you ever use the word you once in this paragraph it's just information so you gotta have, make it sure it looks like a, a, a directions all right, so your last step is fame, which remember the whole essay should be leading to fame. So fame shouldn't be one of your main points because that's the last thing that you're going to get. All right, so we shocked the world. We got attention. And now I don't know how you could rephrase this. Um, I don't know, built an empire maybe, something like that, where it would lead to fame. But your whole paragraph is about how it sucks um, you'll have haters so you're finally getting into the second person down here which is good um, people want your money some want to sleep with you um, they hate you you'll have stalkers um, you have to do a bunch of interviews which are dumb um, do you think it's really smart to get fame I don't know we should all ponder this that's not second person point of view but this whole paragraph isn't <laughs> isn't persuading me to go for fame and fortune so I'm not exactly sure um, how you want to frame this um, so I would really think in long and hard about how this is gonna all work because I don't know if this is a good place to go I know it's not a good place to go so we need to change that paragraph alright so we want to repeat our main points you have space issues all over the place too many spaces here uh, make sure you fix that. Only one space after uh, end mark. Uh, again, we need to develop a strong thesis to have at the end here. Uh, make sure you go through each main point and really take a sentence to talk about it. Um, there are proof if you follow steps, you will get to the ending desire, fame. That really awkwardly worded. You want to change that. 
Um, we get to make choices whether it's worth it or not. That's a really weird statement to make at the end. Not really necessarily goes with your topic. Um, so anyways, you got to really work on everything. So thesis, restate your thesis, main point, each gets a sentence of summary, and then have a really strong ending part. Um, but overall, Gabe, just make sure that it's a, an instruction manual, that you're telling people how to do this concept of being rich and famous. Um, keep thinking about it that way, and hopefully the steps will make more sense to you. But you got it done, and I was a little late um, getting it done, uh, but you got it done. Um, but I really think I want you to, I really would prefer that you do a rewrite because I really want to see this expand and, and get better. So um, good luck on the rewrite. Hopefully um, you'll take it to heart and, and really work on your writing.